compiling reports and looking at our damage assessments that we've been receiving throughout the last 24 hours. And what we have is we have a couple of road closures in Hilo uh, because of ponding, Kamehameha Avenue, Railroad Avenue. Um, but damage assessments, we had about 3,600 customers of Helco get impacted. Uh, we've had about 25 in Paradise Park, 50 in Mountain View, another 70 in Pahala, another 800 plus down in Ocean View, South Point area. Uh, all of the power has been restored. Uh, so we're still watching because we're waiting for about 1 a.m. to uh, make sure that uh, the storm, uh, Madeline, has passed us in its entirety and we're not being affected by any, any attendant wind and rain. Uh, but we're still concerned about surges on the east and southeast coastlines uh, combined with big surf and hoping that uh, the speed uh, of Madeline and the rain doesn't uh, uh, impact shoreline coastline areas, east, southeast areas. That's our concern in the next, in the next five hours or so. Still tropical storm morning. You know, from yesterday, we, we were 110 miles an hour, down to 90, down to 80, 75, uh, 65. Uh, so still a lot of wind, still a lot of concern. We've seen with Darby that even though the system can break up, even though you still have remnants, you could still have uh, impact on your community because of the rain. And we are pretty saturated now because we've had some sustained rain for a few days. Uh, but we will be closing our shelters that have not been occupied, do not have anyone in them. Uh, we'll keep the ones that are open here in East Hawaii and Puna uh, that have people who are sheltering there. Everybody seems to have been sheltering in place. Uh, community has been staying off the roads. Tomorrow uh, at 3 a.m. we'll be resuming Hele on bus service. We'll be opening all county offices and county operations. We'll also be opening all of our transfer stations and landfills. Um, but we'll be looking at uh, parks and recreation facilities on a case-by-case -case basis. But we'll be looking at opening up all of our parks and recreational facilities that we can. Uh, gyms, parks and pools, Muni Golf Course, the zoo. And uh, unless we see anything significant or substantial, throughout the evening and early morning hours, that's what we'll be doing. No, we had about 18 foot surf down in Pohiki. Uh, so we pulled our jet skis out of the water. Uh, a lot of debris in the ocean, uh, being very cautious, trying to earn a side of safety. And uh, no, but other than big surf, uh, other than um, concerns of water safety, uh, we haven't had any reports of any extensive damage at this point in time at the EOC. Yeah, so hopefully we can return to normalcy tomorrow, Thursday, all county operations. Our schools will still be closed. We'll still see over the weekend um, sports activities, interscholastic sports between schools are, have been canceled. Uh, the university will uh, resume tomorrow, Thursday. And so, uh, yeah, we'll start to see that, but uh, we'll start again, start to ramp up preparation throughout Friday in anticipation of Leicester.